Hey, what's up everybody? I want to take a real quick time out, time out to give a shout out to Audible and to also invite you all to come download the app Audible and get, you know, I'm always talking about books. A lot of y'all ask me for my book selection and recommendations and I'm in a good one right now and I'm listening to it from Audible. You guys can listen to it as well. Just use, go to audible.com backslash haterproof or text haterproof to 500-500. Some of you may or may not know I'm now vegan. Um, I'm just giving it a go. And I was like, I need a practical approach to this. So I found the perfect book and the book is called The Happy Herbivore, A Practical Guide to Plant-Based Living. Uh, the author is Lindsay Nixon. And this book gives you a real comprehensive breakdown on how to, you know, explaining you being a vegan or, or vegetarian to your family, to your friends, different options that you could choose when you're out at restaurants, if you're out at weddings, because what makes it difficult is the convenience. That's what took me so long to cross all the way over. Um, so this book, I highly recommend it. This is what I'm reading right now. And this is what I want y'all to check out. And I'm not trying to push veganism on any of you guys. I'm doing it strictly for my health. Uh, once I cut out meat, pretty much all the inflammation, the pain that I was feeling in my body is gone. Uh, I had really bad pain in my knees. I thought I needed surgery. My doctor saw no structural damage, so that meant it was, it was food. It was what I was eating, it was inflammation. And I'm telling you, once I cut the meat out, it's gone. There's so many, so many benefits to plant-based uh, living. Even my doctor is a vegan one of my doctors, and this guy is about 80 years old. His mind is fully intact, he's sharp, he looks good, slim and trim. Everywhere I look, everywhere I research, I'm finding nothing but good information on being a uh, vegan and living a plant-based lifestyle. I haven't found anything negative about it. I'm sure there's people that may have emotional or really special attachments to uh, meat eating diets and whatnot, and that's fine. I'm not, I don't think eating meat is the worst thing in the world. Uh, Part of the reason that I don't eat meat anymore is because you really don't know where this stuff is being sourced at, where it's coming from, and what kind of conditions these animals are in, or what kind of hormones is being pumped into these animals. So I, I just don't trust it, you know? And it's not, we're not in a time to where we have to hunt to survive. We have many options, you know what I mean? So eh, me personally, I choose to not eat the meat. Another thing that I love about Audible is the fact that the selection, uh, I mean, it's, you have a universe of, of, of books. You have an infinite amount of books, it seems. Their, their selection is unmatched. You're not gonna find that selection anywhere else. And if you ever decide to cancel, which you shouldn't, why would you do that? Your books are yours. Once they're yours, they're yours. You can always go back and re-listen to them at a later date, whenever you choose. So. Big shout out to Audible. Once again, use my link to get a free 30 days subscription. It's audible.com backslash haterproof. And you can also text haterproof to 500-500. That's a free 30 day trial. It's on me, it's on your boy. I'm hooking y'all up, all right? Let's get into this workout. Good. 